Hey, hey, it's the Soliday Scoop, and I'm your host, Caleb Soliday. Yay! Cheesy, uh, probably not my best singing, but uh, comment your thoughts on this below. Any intro ideas you have, comment below. Break out those tissue boxes, this is going to be an emotional ride through the news. The first tidbit of news, real sad, everybody knows Post Jeopardy, Alex Trebek passed away in November of last year. Um, however, his last episode of him hosting Jeopardy, Jeopardy, the show will continue through guest hosts. Um, Alex Trebek has hosted all but one episode of Jeopardy. Um, and it aired this past Friday with an emotional tribute of all the years of him hosting it into like one short combo video it's really sad highly recommend you go look it up on youtube um his last confirmed appearance is scheduled for may 21st of this year in the movie free guy he has a small cameo in the movie it's gonna be the last time we see alex Trebek on screen it's gonna be really sad and, you know you're gonna miss him rest in peace alex trump banned from twitter permanently comment your thoughts on this below because twitter that's why it happened uh, comment below and uh biden officially becoming president in 10 days january 20th is his inauguration um because he had 306 electoral votes compared to Trump's 232 electoral votes. So Biden's going to become the president. Comment your thoughts on this below. Even though it might cause a debate in the comments. It's going to be better than the debates we've had these last couple elections. So comment your thoughts below. Um, everyone close your eyes. Picture your childhood home. Maybe you're playing in the backyard with some of your friends or if you had siblings siblings having fun and all of a sudden war breaks out and you're forced away from your childhood home and because you're a little kid at the time you don't understand why and you're really upset and sad and decades pass by like lots of decades we're talking at least eight decades which is 80 years you didn't you want to go see your childhood home and you just can't because of a conflict this exact scenario happen is going on in Korea right now with 66,000 displaced North Koreans that are currently in South Korea and can't go back to their childhood homes in North Korea due to the conflict in Korea um, one of these 66,000 displaced North Koreans however got to see their childhood home this past week through the power of VR and although it wasn't a physical trip it was the next best thing it's really sad especially considering that he said he has a cozy little village surrounded by mountains that he used to live in as a child and he hasn't seen this since 1947 imagine not being able to see the place where you grew up in that long that's a long time it's, like I said a little emotional so get those tissues get those tears out of your eyes and uh, it happened through the power of sketch artists using old books and drawing out how they described how they pictured their home and they got they were worried that it wouldn't be what the person expected it to be however after taking the glasses off and, you know getting to see it through VR the part, they said the person was crying really emotionally and they said it's just how they remembered it it's really neat that they're doing stuff like that I'm just saying it's not all bad news. There's good, there's there's good people in the world today. Let's be honest. Um, so uh, that's our holiday scoop. 
Um, I hope you guys are still keeping your New Year's resolutions out there. I don't know if you think you are. My New Year's resolution this year was to stay more organized. So I got myself a handy dandy planner. I'm using to stay more organized in. Um, we're gonna rock on out of here with some music, but in the meantime, we just want to say don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for updates YouTube. when the next Solidary Scoop YouTube. is uploaded. Blah, 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 blah. This is totally going to become a blooper. Boom! Did I scare you? Good. Because I was trying to. Woo! Woo! Hey, hey, it's the Solidary Scoop. Nope, that's not how it goes. I messed up my own intro song. This is... Hey! Nope. Hey! It's the Solidary Scoop. Nope, that doesn't work. Nope. Woo! Hey, hey, it's the Solidary Scoop. And I'm your host, Caleb Solidary. Yay! That's eh, not as catchy. We put this in the bloopers. <laughs> Ain't seen nothing. <laughs>